Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm sure you guys all saw this headline, made me laugh when I saw it, but apparently an astronaut recently dropped something during a routine spacewalk. And not like a tool or a screw, an entire tool bag. And when you drop something in space, you can't exactly pick it back up because it floats away and then it starts orbiting the Earth. And the internet is having a very good time on Astronaut Tool Bag Watch 2023. So I thought I would join the masses and today we will look at exactly what happened. That poor astronaut. So the two NASA astronauts that were out for their routine spacewalk were Jasmine Mogbelly and Laurel O'Hara. They were performing maintenance on the exterior of the station. And according to a NASA blog post from November 1st, during the activity, one tool bag was inadvertently lost. And you can actually kind of see it go in one of the astronauts' helmet cams. NASA went on to say that flight controllers spotted the bag using external station cameras, but that the tools were not needed for the remainder of the spacewalk, which definitely made me laugh. Like, yeah, yeah, we lost it, but we didn't really need any of those tools anymore anyway. <laughs> So the tool bag is now circling the planet in low Earth orbit. But according to NASA, the tool bag does not pose any danger to the ISS. NASA said Mission Control analyzed the bag's trajectory and determined that risk of recontacting the station is low and that the onboard crew and space station are safe with no action required. But since then, the lost tool bag has become a new artificial star in the night sky. Dave Dickinson, author of the book The Backyard Astronomer's Field Guide, How to Find the Best Objects the Night Sky Has to Offer, posted on Twitter that the tool bag is orbiting about a minute ahead of the space station. Dickinson has said that the bag has a stellar magnitude of plus six, which means it may be difficult to spot with the naked eye, but with a pair of binoculars, you might be able to see it. Stellar magnitude is used to describe a star's apparent brightness in the night sky. The mag the magnitude scale spans negative 30 to plus 30, with the brightest objects being assigned the smallest numbers, and the faintest objects having the largest numbers. So a full moon, for example, has a magnitude of minus 12.6, while the Hubble Space Telescope is closer to plus 30. Sky watchers who want to see if they can spot the tool bag should head outside on a clear night, but first see where the ISS is passing overhead. And NASA actually has a spot the station website and app that can help people track the ISS based on their location. The ISS is typically the third brightest object in the night sky, and according to NASA, it sort of looks like a fast moving plane to the naked eye. Then to see the lost bag, you can use a pair of binoculars to look just a little bit ahead of the space station's path, looking for a faint moving object leading the way. And that, my friends, will be our lonely little tool bag. Somebody from the Caribbean Astronomy Society posted a video purporting to be the tool bag on November 11th. I can neither confirm nor deny, but I will share that video with you guys now. The tool bag will likely remain visible for the next few months until its orbit eventually degrades and it falls back towards Earth. Like other objects in low Earth orbit, it will eventually burn up in the atmosphere, which kind of makes me sad, but I have a habit of anthropomorphizing everything. I will put a link to NASA's Spot the Station in the description below. It's tough for me to see stuff like that living in such a big city, but if any of you are able to see it, please let me know. So that's the tale of the lost little tool bag. This is what happens when you drop things in space. They end up on fire, hurtling back towards Earth. RIP tool bag. Please let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And to those of you who celebrate it, happy Thanksgiving. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, I'll see you in the next video.